All right, everybody, welcome back to some more Portal 2 Community Chambers. Today, strap yourselves in. We are back with another Atom map. And this one is called Catalyst. Uh, hey, guys, welcome to Catalyst. Normally, this test chamber was made for beginners, uh, but was closed down to, to due down to renovation for 100 years, but now it's finally open for testing. Uh, Catalyst laser best test chamber, laser best test chamber that focuses on one laser, and the cubes from Tombstone has come again for another comeback. Tombstone, Tombstone, I can't remember. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Good luck and enjoy it. Also, my, the chamber may be a little unforgiving, so massive apologies for that. Okay, so we need to save quite often. It's a five to eight out of ten. Music is from Mike, and there is moving the. Cube while aiming at the laser is not intended, switch snatching cubes near, near a field at lightning speed is not intended, and angled layers through portals, ninja moves, etc., are not performed in this map. I need to learn how to speak. Um, yeah, you know what? The last time I did a co op live stream was a long time ago. I also also a little bit down, that should be a bit better. Yeah, um, I don't know. I've like been finishing off like let's plays and things and then i feel i felt a bit guilty because i hadn't like streamed portal for so long hence why i'm doing sort of like four portal streams back to back this one being number three um so i don't know i will I'm, I, I really do need to try and make more of an effort to uh, do some community nights again it's been uh, it's been a hot moment so i'm just trying to think about tombstone and what tombstone was And it doesn't ring a bell to me at the moment. All right, well, we have a cube. We have another cube. Our portal two co-op maps. We had this discussion last night, and it was like, nope. <laughs> I I don't really play portal two community maps for the simple reason that the only the only the only re, the only time I ever play them is so Deathwish can destroy me with rockets. So. Right, let's try and buckle down a little bit, I guess. And see what we can do in this one. So, not sure why there I would want. Why would I want that there for the stairs? Maybe somewhere down the line I'm going to need to fling. Sorry, Coco. I, I can only apologize for the length of time it has been. Please accept my sincere apologies. And so that's square here. Yeah, okay, so we could potentially do it. We could potentially fling that. Okay. Flinging may be an option. That's what square does. No worries, Mr. Fab. I appreciate everybody's uh, everybody's uh, played bits and pieces. So uh, thanks for stopping by and saying hi anyway. Have a good rest of the evening. Dino Killer's here. He wasn't there when you solved the living map, but I checked the VOD. You cleared it. It's been less than three hours. It, well, it, it didn't feel impressive. Three hours on a map does not feel impressive to me, but thanks anyway, Dino. Appreciate that. We're... Uh, out the fire and into the frying pan, so to speak. Is that the, out the frying pan is the fire? I can't remember the way around that um, analogy goes, but yeah, from one one crater to another, we are now playing a map from Atom. So I'm expecting to be here pretty much all night again with this, if not longer. Speak of the devil. There he is. What's going on, Adam? Welcome, welcome. Hope you are doing well. Okay, so... 
I think here. Oh wait, I can't get back. Oh yes, I can. There's something. It's here. Here it is. All my cubes fizzle, all right? That's what's gonna happen, isn't it? Yes. Alright, that's fine though. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take my horse, the old town road. Ride till I can't ride anymore. Oh, you know what? That was silly. I shouldn't have done did that. There was a much better move I could have done there. Let's get around that. Let's just cause this to juggle a moment. Although, sorry doing that, but I don't know which which the cube is in, so... Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to reset again. We will reset everything again. Because Nock did a clumbo. And we need to reset some stuff. So, blue portal there. Messy with so we're doing it there, we're instead going to do there. Now we can point this over to here. Like so. Nerdlin, what is going on? How you doing? Hope you're well. Excellente. Spanish for excellent. In case you didn't know. So what we can now do is portal here, take this one away, this can go through here. Seems like good progress, but let's make a save spot. Right, so next up. Okay, maybe we want to get this cube. Oh, wait a second. Maybe not. Actually, maybe what we actually want to do is this. Still going to have to fizzle that, though. A wild death wish appears. What's going on, buddy? How you doing? All right, so the problem is here. Now I brought this cube through, we can't then undo that. So let's do our first load of the night. Let's take this back through to here, just so this is on the right side. There. Now we can take this and point it over in this direction there. And switch the... Switch the wrong pole surface. That's what we're going to do. Always helpful.
So we have that there, that there. This now enables us to bring the cube through to this side, right? I think that's, um, that's Libby's custom item, isn't it? Bars. Or one of Libby's custom items. I suppose to fizzle this. Oh, it doesn't respawn. Well, crud. Well, let's do this instead. It's pretty sure I'll bring this cube over here. Will be important to the cause. Ultimately, what we're going to need is a portal on there, I think, a portal on there, and feed the laser through here, redirect it here, and then redirect it to here. I don't know why we'd need to do that, because if we... Once we get the laser there, coming through here, we can place a cube there, point it there, other cube on the bottom and we're out. So maybe that's the exit setup. Maybe. Portal there. Portal there. Cube. Cube. I'm guessing this will reset. Yeah, five cubes. Helpful text. All right, so we have a rough idea of what we might need to do. What's bugging me at the minute, though? I'm going to have to check your workshop out now. Which one Tombstone was? Which one was Tombstone? This one. Is it the one I think it is? Hey, look, I was the last one to comment on this. I think this is the one I think it is. I, I'm thinking it is. And if I remember right, there was like a little channel. Yeah, there was a channel under the laser fizzler here, under the laser field. Okay, yeah, so it's, it's the map I thought it was. Uh, what I'm deducing from that. Okay, so. Um, I'm guessing this is where the laser fizzler possibly was before. Okay, so, 
Maybe that's wrong. Maybe we need to put the... Honestly, I don't, don't remember anything about the soul, the soul of itself, so... This, um... This could be interesting. Um... have to use that to go through there at some point. And I guess the idea behind that is we fling. Well, yeah. In essence, we're going to have... Yeah, I did see Hugo had favorited it when I was um, fumbling my way through the description. Okay, so we need the other cube. To do that, we would need the other cube here already. So... Um, what to do? We can't, we can't extract that cube now, can we? Not with this setup here. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Variant. That one sounds tasty. The tasty variant. Leave this here. And let's... This is the um, definition of madness percent here. As Deathwish would call it. Repeating the same thing over and over again. Expecting a different result. Uh, this here. So once we get the lasers all round, we're going to need a laser there, the cube there, and the cube there. Um, I think. Unless we can find another direct route to hit that cube. I'm not sure what the point would be of this one, though. Unless it's to simply... I suppose the point of this would be we would, and this is working backwards again, we'd have both the cubes here, but not the laser. Therefore, you'd have like laser, uh, you'd have cubes in position here to point to there, and you'd be working back from over here.
So then you would set the, the portal surface one there, one there. I assume you can see this from there. Yes, you can. So this field would be open. You would shoot that to there. That would then raise the stairs. We could walk up here and then we could set up the rearranged cubes for the finale. Okay, so that's another piece of the puzzle that we've just unlocked there. Thanks to Iron's question. So... I dare say there is an angle from over here some... Oh, intro. Oh, we got stuff going on there. Is there an angle there? Yeah, there's an angle there to hit that stairs from here. So you could be sneaky, put a portal here, and then balance your cube over there, potentially, and point it over there. So that both of these panels here are blocking that shot there, Iron, I would say. I'm sure Atom will confirm if that is the case. So we've got one cube that respawns, one cube that doesn't. Or... No, they neither of them respawn. Okay. So... Um... Here's what I'm thinking. Cube on square. Activates that panel there. We so we want square active. We also want this fizzler open. Um, the fizzler was open. If if we can do this in a way, I guess we could do it. We'd have to. Sw so we need to swap the cubes. I think the cube swap is. Um, top priority so we would have the black cube on the conductive plate the white cube would be on the square button Problem is, though, once I do that, I can't get to take the cube back through here. That's an issue. Because the only way to open that fizzler up from this side is to use a cube and redirect. So, what we'd have to do here... Place the cube in here first. Like this. Then we would need to shoot to there, which will allow us to take the cube out of this barred area here. And that will allow us now to reopen this. Now we can go and place our cube back over here. Of course, the person that uh, placed this cube was a little bit drunk. That would have been like that. Okay, so cubes are now swapped. Cubes are now swapped. So from here, we can now move this cube to here to give us the stairs. Great. Maybe. Okay.
Now I guess we get the black cube back with a laser respawn. Is all well and good. Oh, we need that to be in there. Reverse, reverse. So can we do this setup here without the white cube? Okay. Once again, my things are a little bit drunk. We don't have a way now to get back to that cube there, do we? I mean, we do. We can do this and this. But we don't have a way to now point the laser over here, do we? I think the ideal solution there would have been what? I could say to move, have a cube on square so we could have potentially flung a way up to there. But I don't see how that would work. to do. You see, that messes everything up every time I do that. Hmm. <laughs> we need to use the fling pits and the two angled panels.
Could I do something where I leave the cube this side? Alright, let's... Whatever we do, we need to do the cube swap. It's a thing that needs to be done. Pretty sure. So let's do that now. Okay. Cube is swapped. Now we go over here. Now, we can do multiple things here. But I think for now, we want this fling pit here. This isn't intended, but it's gonna get me uh, in somebody's bad box, I know. But you see, my idea here would be something like this, so that I can then do this. up to here and through here. And then having that and that, we could then get the laser back. I know I, I'm, I'm not, don't worry though guys, I'm not happy with that fling move that I just did, don't worry. I'm just testing the waters here. And then with that and that... Maybe I don't need to fling out of this one. Maybe the idea of this is simply this. Because then I could effectively do... Now I need to get the cube. I can easily pick the cube up though from here. Instead though, what I would really want to do is
This is where we need to target that with the laser. Somehow. Somehow, some way. We've got lots of like interesting ideas, but the problem is they're all a bit disjointed at the minute. And plus, we haven't even used the other area on the left hand side behind the fizzler. My issue here would be. I don't know how to hit that from here. Because we'd have to drop down here to bring this through. Which is all well and good. And then, you know, you can start to do bits and pieces like this. However, without having a setup on the laser and a portal on the other side over here, we're pretty screwed. So, maybe, maybe I respawned the black cube too early. All right, let's... Let's go back a little bit here. So if I had to hazard a guess, which I, you never have to guess, but if I had to hazard a guess, swapping the cubes is the right thing to do. It's always a big concern when you're playing maps like this, like the more complicated maps, that you you think something is right, but you're not sure. And it's like, do you commit to the save spot or not? It's always like a massive dilemma. Okay, and this goes back into here. So, what I'm instead thinking is we actually use the black cube. Once we've extracted the, the white cube or the, the plain cube, whatever you want to call it, we then use the black cube to be able to get through here and place the portal in the right position here. I think. Nerdling with the three month Twitch Prime resub, my man. Thank you very much. Really do appreciate the support. Thank you, thank you. It does mean a lot. Especially given you have the whole of Twitch to use a Twitch Prime sub and you chose to use it on my channel. I appreciate it, buddy. Thank you very much. Yo, Mika! There he is. How was your first day out of isolation, dude? Hope you're living it up. 
had a massive rager of a party and all that sort of jazz. <laughs> Just kidding, of course. How does it feel to be a free man? Oh yeah, dentist, of course. Yikes. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Big yikes. This does feel like progress. However, I feel here Okay, I think what I need to do a portal on there. So I put a portal there with a cube up there as well. Okay, let me let me go back. So I think I swapped the cubes. Okay, this is this is gonna get something. Um, all right, so first of all, step one, swap the cubes. I'm still really tentative though, like to create the save spot, which is the annoying thing. to um, shoot things in a straight line. All right, so. Yo, Karuja, what's going on? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're well. How you doing today? So now we have this. We remove that and we do that. Okay. So, if this is right, what we now need to do... Okay. Can we do this? I don't see a reason we can't do this. This comes down to now keeping the portal management alive. Um, so we have a, a queue, which we work from normally. Um, however, we are quite backed up at the moment. So we can you can submit. It is possible to submit a map to the queue. Um, but we can't guarantee when we will get to that map, unfortunately. Anyway, let me do this. So this is what I'm thinking here. But before we make this sacrifice here...
we would have need to have moved the red cube already. Sorry. No, we, not the red cube. We need to move the black cube into position so that we can activate these stairs. Okay. May not be... This is where we would need to have... Maybe we need to bring the black cube back in here first. Could be a possibility. I'm just... It's so hard to think whether or not we need to save or not. That's the problem. No. I don't say that's a problem, but it's not a problem. Okay. There is a there is a problem here though. And that is getting this cube back in position over here now. It was pretty. It was really impressive, Deathwish. That's um, she's got some skills, man. I'll tell you. We all got skills, man. Yeah, he did, Mika, but I don't think it's as bad as I think. I think we was all good up, the, up to a point there. And the point was moving this cube off the button to point it to here. In an ideal world, what we would have now what would we have now? This would need to point to there. In an ideal world, we'd have that and that. That would open that. Okay. And we could switch this one to there. Again, this is just playing around with ideas to see what we come up with. So ideally, here, I think the portal now you see we can't can't um 
Can't do the laser portalless. Not the answer. Annoyingly as well, I think Atom's done a runner, but I can't actually validate anything. Dude, every time. I swear, this laser just, like, moves itself every time. For real. spacebar which ironically I don't really use my spacebar anymore <laughs> the irony uh, this is um, Mike Mike's some of Mike's music Mika Did was it? No. Here's what I did. So I need to keep the portal over this side. I've looked at that platform, but I know for a fact I can't see that from there. You see, I don't know. I kind of feel like I want some form of justification or validation, not justification, validation that this is the correct path. Swapping the cubes. Still not sure. No, it doesn't matter because I can walk. I can work my way backwards. I was thinking, so I get a pull there, but how can I get the laser back? Because. I won't have stairs, but of course, that's what that cube does there. As long as we keep that there, 
and we're up the top here. We can work our way back, come back down to here, portal to there, and that'll obviously work its way around and give us the stairs back up to there. So, on the basis this is correct, so far, Is this next move here? Do you know what? I'm going to have to... Um... I'm going to save it as like a separate save state. Just to confirm that. Alright. So this one is zero. Now I have both. Loud? No, I want to load. Okay. So. That's fine. But how do we move that cube? Need to move the black cube. Which we can do by firing a portal there and moving it. Portal there with the delay. Actually, it might work. My work. Alright, so don't worry about having the portal on the right surface there for now. We move this one to here. This gives us the stairs. So then, with the stairs, think about where we're going to want to go here. go down here or we could go down here if it matters is with this is doesn't really um let's see what this would do for me I could do this right and come out of here.
But now I have no way back through this fizzler without resetting portals again. Which is problematic. Yo, Deathwish with 100 bits. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. who took 11 vaccine shots. What? Crazy. Heal his leg. Yeah, uh, I need to use the country's supply of vaccines because I've got this. I've got this paper cut on my leg. And, um, it, it it helps to heal it. Problem is this cube. It's not really a problem. Alright, so what if we kind of like take it back? kind of wondering here. Like, I could. I could totally do it. Okay, so. What if we null portal? And then... Okay, this beyond something. Let's see if I can line it up this time, shall we? I'm going to say there. Hey, we got it. Fantastic. Oh my god, somebody, somebody get on that right now. I want to be famous. I want the followers. Man, every time, Death Wish. Jeez. Seriously, man, every time. Every time I think my luck is in. Alright, so... 
We now have this situation. Which is great. Apart from the fact that we need to do stuff. These mistakes are made, buddy. I'll let you off. See, if we could achieve this... Oh, uh, uh... We... No. I was thinking maybe the cube spot was a bad idea, because we could respawn... Respawn the white so it was over this side from here. Hmm. Village noises intensify. Okay. Again, it's what if time. So what if we had this with this? Actually what we're gonna do is swap the cube so it's sat here. So we have this, we have this, and then this would have been sat. Yeah, because that's just enable us to do this, right? So then we could go through here now that we've got that open. We can respawn the white cube. But that doesn't really change we had, does it? Does it? it? I think it does. This is basically what we had before. Which then means it comes down to... See, I don't see why... I don't see where the white or the, the plane cube would respawn and come into the solution. I'm trying to think backwards a moment just to see if I can work out what it is that I need to do. I mean, I'm assuming Black Cube needs to be somewhere. I don't know where the Black Cube needs to be. But what we're going to have, in effect... Is this... No. Hold on. That wasn't right.
we're gonna have, I think... This. So to have this, we would have needed some stairs, but in effect... We're gonna do... I don't end up with this cube. Oh, I swapped the cubes, didn't I? Damn. Alright, let's just ignore that we've got that cube at the moment. We're in full-blown hypotheses mode here. We'd have this cube. We'd have this set up here. So we'd respawn that, like so. Now we would need to keep... I think we would then need to take this with us. We don't need the laser at this point. Yeah, we need to take the laser. Because we then need to do this. Okay. Then, from here, we can do this. This is how we get this one back. Because now we can walk up to here. We have the laser in position there. We then point this to here. We take this one. And we point this one to here. And then... Do that which gives us the stairs. We walk up to here. Be very careful how we do this, but we need to remove this one first. Yeah, that's why we need to be careful. But yeah, we remove this one first. Then we take this one. And we do that. Okay. So we've we've put a bit more the ending together. Okay. A bit more of the ending has been pieced together. The issue comes... Deathwish, thanks for another hundred, buddy. Right, so what we need to figure out now is... We need a way... Two. Ah, maybe, actually. What if... Black cube there... Was that on there? Okay, so... What if this cube here... Was pointing here. This cube is pointing in there like that. There is no need, I don't think, 
If we can get the cube, the white cube, or the clear cube, whatever you want to call it, over to where we are in the exit entrance area, then there would be no need to move this cube because... Um, where is my white cube? White cube is trapped behind that. All right, so just let me test this hypothesis. So, can we... This would have to be set up like this. And this. This. The point there. So. Interesting to note. I can see both the catches from this point if that cube is oriented correctly. So, is there a way... There's always a way. But is there a way? I can effectively set this up. Then move the cube into the black cube into position. Alright. Let's ponder this avenue for a moment. So, if that is the case, swapping the cube was the right thing to do. So let's bring the white cube out here a moment. This is going to have to move here for a start. That's right there. We need this to be on the other side, I think. That's why this wouldn't work here. Alright, well, let's just do this real quick because we know we've done this set of like hundreds of times. Move this into the cage area first. Okay. Is 
See, that's all right, but we now... We don't have a way to activate that against that cube, do we? Sure, we can do that. But that doesn't help. Ooh. I think um, being rich is not just like a lot of well, some people feel that being rich isn't about money, it's just about you know whether or not they've got the the nicer things in life. So yeah, I mean, if that guy, you know, that guy obviously feels like he's, um, he has everything he needs, and because of that feeling that he gets, he, um, but yeah, well, I, I feel like a rich man, sort of thing. That makes sense. So I kind of feel here Again, this comes back to free of portal management. Okay, you just want to phase through the side of the portal, that's fine by me. Well, yeah, I mean, you know, I don't want to touch, I don't want to, like, I don't want to touch on, like, um, weird subjects or anything, but I always think to myself, you know, obviously being, being famous... I don't think it's all it's rich and famous isn't all it's cracked up to be because yeah, you know, as you've rightly sort of said, um their death wish uh, sort of touched on briefly. Um you often see in the news of um you know these people who you sort of see their lifestyles and and, and you, I know you can't always believe what journalists report. But you see the sort of lifestyle that the journalists portray that they're having and, and sort of like what they're doing and you kind of think, well, does rich, being rich and being famous, does that lead to sort of like a a life of substance misuse, uh, which ultimately, you know, results in losing lives and things? I, if, if being rich and famous puts that much pressure on somebody, then, you know, I, I'm really not interested in that in the slightest, to be fair. I'd much rather, you know, just do my thing do the family thing and um, feel, feel like I'm rich in that way. As long as I've sort of got, you know, solid people all around me, then to me that's all that really matters.
I'm struggling here. I've... I kind of... I kind of have the end sequence planned out. I'm concerned though that I haven't used that I won't have used that panel there. That's the concern. I feel like I'm comparing like to like last night's map. I feel like we've. I feel like I'm in a better position overall because I've got. I've got a lot more planned out in my head and like the roadmap for everything. It's just like a couple of intricate moves that I'm missing. A couple of intricacies. check how that respawned but it bounces off the ground so it's always going to be quite sporadic so we maybe entertain this idea again for a moment So what if we did this? Uh, but if we did this, would it be possible to... I think the answer is no. If cubes were swapped the other way around, it would be possible, because we could then... Um, hmm. It though, no, I don't think it would. I was thinking if it the cubes were the other way around, we'd res we could respawn respawn the white cube or the plain cube, but that would just land in exactly the same position, so respawning that would be pretty pointless.
The issue is here, moving black cube now um, breaks everything. Because there's no way then we open this fizzler and move one of the if I move one of the um, portal surfaces here to try and move that black cube, um, see, you've uh, have you not been here for a while, Adam? I've not seen you. Uh, the, the viewers list. One story, one desert monk. So I was rebooked him. We booked him. Spent time with the poor guy. <laughs> on the treats they asked why you spend so much time in this monk answered I haven't even learned half things of what he knows that's it you you know stereotypical isn't it you see somebody poor and it's like what, what are you doing with him you know not thinking that you know that, that poor guy might have knowledge and wisdom that um, they're willing to share with others Alright, I need to grab a glass of water because I'm all out of a drink. Give us two sex guys and I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. Um, okay, Atom. Since you're now here, um, can I run through what I believe to be the um, ending sequence with you? Um, or a sequence of events that leads to the end. And could you, if I run through this, can you like say yay or nay on this sequence? So here's, here's what I got. Are we sitting comfortably? Are we paying attention? I hope so. So that points to here. We've got laser coming through there and there. And we've already got a nay. Okay, well. Yikes. Last 45 minutes has been a waste of time then. Here's, here's what we're doing. I'll, I will show you anyway what we were doing. So here's what we're doing. We was um, we did this. We respawned the black cube there, like so. This is part of the solution. So then we do this down to here. And actually, I did that somewhere else, but it doesn't matter. We can still get the same. No, hold on. Oh, I missed something. Okay, actually, I wasn't meant to go down there. So we respawn black. Then we go down to here. We put that on there. We take black. Actually, we don't take black. We put black up here. We then do this to jump down to here. Which gets us our black cube here. We can then run down here to redo this. And then we can put our cube over to here. We can now walk out of the pit. Like so, with our portal in the correct position. This points to this cube. This one comes over here and points to this cube. Uh, we then run back around to here and we do that. That gives us the stairs to get back up to the top here. And then we ever so carefully need to do that. 
that. Point that to there. And do that to there. So it's the ending sequence, but there is one wrong move. So let's see. I feel like this is a good move. Problem with this is. I don't know from here how to move black into a position where I can activate the stairs. See if I do this if I do this here then um I can't do anything. Terrible. Terrible. I'm gonna drive to your house. Again, the minute I do that, I've lost a portal on the... Portal. Things inside, therefore I can't then do anything without resetting the whole thing. How about, how about, that's what we'll do. Don't tell him. Right, what we'll do is we'll just... Start playing something else. We won't even solve it. You'll never know. You'll never know. Genius. What I'll do is I'll just like... I'll... I'll take the stream down for like five minutes. I'll bring it back up. And when I come back, I'll be like... I haven't noticed that the stream's gone down. And we'll just be playing something else. And you'll never know. Nobody will ever know. Everything will be masked. And yeah, it's all gravy. It's all gravy. I need to work out here. What else I can do? Hey guys, what else can I do? Could
Yes, I did just jump off there. Why is that so, like, massively off position? Okay. So we could do that. And then... What? difficulty is the difficulty comes in that the laser is not independent i.e. we have to use portals with the laser I think that's what makes everything so difficult in this one. legs be getting a bit tired Now, I could go through here, and I could now respawn white. about all I can do again, isn't it? Hush about 500 euros to get back into driving me, yikes. That's a lot of money. breaks everything again there, doesn't it? Yeah, it sounds like a bit like here, to be fair, Deathwish. Where I live, it's like you get a bus past your house, or, well, if we're lucky, we get a bus past the house like probably once an hour. Trains, if you get the train anywhere, it just takes you an absolute age to get to like one of the main lines. 
It's like whenever I go to London, I can drive to London in about two hours. Um, or I could get a train where I have to, like, make... I have to get somebody to drive me 20 minutes to a train station, then take a train another 20 minutes to get to the main line, and then change there and get, like, a, another train, take, like, an hour, an hour and a quarter in, and it's just, like, nearly three hours. Then to get to my office, I have to get a tube 20 minutes across London, then go to another train station and get another train for half an hour out of the centre of London to actually where my office is. And it's just like, I'll just take the car. It's so much easier. Um... I'm I'm sort of struggling here. The thing is, like, I think where I live, I live about um, probably a mile, no more than a mile and a half outside of the town centre. And if I want to get the bus into my town centre, it costs, it will cost me, like, to go a mile and a half with my kids and, and, every, and, and my wife, it will cost me the best part of, like, 10, 15 pounds to get a bus to go a mile and a half there and back, so three miles in total. It's just, I don't know, it's just, it's just not affordable for us around here. It's not, it's not available enough, and it's not affordable. It's ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. We don't have Ubers. Taxis are stupidly priced as well. So, yeah, I'm. I, 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 I know exactly what you're saying, Deathwish. We we would be exactly the same here. Excuse me. Um. Bit of a headache coming on as well, it's not good. What sucks for me even more is that we're a we're a one car household as well. And my wife pretty much works every other day. So like literally when she's out of work, I can't I can't go anywhere. Unless I play a stupid amount of money, or I hope and pray that it ain't raining, so I can go, I can walk somewhere and, and not get wet, kind of thing. So, yeah, it's not great. I kind of feel like... Kind of feel like... I'm missing something important, obviously, because I've not found the solution yet, with this. 
Everything I've seen so far, I haven't used this surface here. But this would make total sense. I don't think it's going to let me do it because conductive plates only tend the air. Conductive plates, as annoying as it is, it's really annoying. They only work with the. Um, they only work with the stuff. Uh, the cubes that are the part of the map. So if you're flying around like this, like trying to work stuff out doesn't work for you. However, what I was trying to get at here was the idea here would be Jesus Christ. Sorry. Let me say that. Um, apologize. Um, excuse me? There we go. So, yeah, the... The idea here... be now to come down to here... Place this onto here. Jump down. Go through. Portal here. So that's what we would need to do there. But how does that help? This and this and this here, yeah. Is this where we could do something like this? Down here, all there, all to there. Not there, but... These were still in place there and there. 
I brought this over to here, like that, that leads us into this maneuver, doesn't it? Which from here I can then do my exit cell. Okay. Okay. You know, Mika, I haven't actually decided yet. I need to decide though, because it will be kicking it off on when next Wednesday. But I honestly haven't um haven't taken the time yet just to sit down and sort of go through everything. So watch this space. Yeah, perhaps. Quite possibly. So, how would we... Let's try something. That's no good either. All right, I'm onto something, but I'm not onto something, if that makes any sense whatsoever. Pretty sure thinking about it, it's not going to make an ounce of sense. Goal here is to get the cube over to the other side. this. 
So then the next goal would be... Keeping a portal there, and getting back through this laser. That's the difficulty. Because that respawns both cubes. I don't know how much longer I can go on for today because I'm really getting, I'm really feeling quite exhausted. Um, which is frustrating because I do feel like we are re relatively close. We, we're just like missing one, maybe two steps. Bars are just the worst, I tell you. So, like, to, to manipulate this, we would need this to be here. So, we need this set up. But we need to be able to deliver the white cube. Right, so if we need to do the white cube. Oh, hold on. Let's put that there. Yeah, the issue here would be we then get it onto the 
base we need to place it on. Obviously, if this was if if that was there, then it'd be relatively simple. We could place we walk up to here, go through the portal, place it on there. No, I'm just I'm just trying different bits and pieces. I'm starting to flag a bit, I'll be honest, Atom. What I've what I realized though, and I'll just show you what we've been doing while you've been not here. I realise I haven't used this panel here. So what I'm thinking is if I can get this cube over to here, what we can potentially do is Come over to here. Jump down here. Go around again. Then we point this one here. And we do boomity boomity. So that would then put me instead for the move I showed you before. Even though you said that there was one move, it still sort of hints to me that that's just what we need to do. So my issue, or my question now, is how I get the cube over to this side. where we come See, while that is all well and good, problem once again, and it has been a recurring problem throughout this entirety of this, is... Places where it needs to be. 
but I can't then place the portals. Who you call him stubborn? I ain't stubborn! What are you talking about? in there. If we then take this, like this, here. This is something we haven't done yet. in the same position, exactly the same position every time. So surely getting the cube over here is so darn important. Yeah, it doesn't usually happen like that at all. It's frustrating me. I'll tell you why it's frustrating me, because like I've already said, compared to Libby's map last night, I feel like I've got far more options. I can see far more moves. But I can't put them together. And that is really frustrating. Yeah, I've pretty much seen the whole ending sequence.
See, what I want to do... Is... It's not Coco, this is the same map. I have to... I have to uh, ignore Death Wish's sarcasm. Trying to think of a way that I can I could activate I'm trying to figure a way I could activate stairs from having the portal coming through here. If I could activate the stairs somehow with a portal coming out here. Which the only way would be if we did this and this and this, which is like the ending maneuver that I've already kind of seen. We could come up to here. Now, we kind of have a cube up there. But what this would allow me to do, I could then drop into here. With the cube on here. Cube just for now to demonstrate. It doesn't, I just, it doesn't matter what we do at the moment. And then I could do stuff like this. I would need both the cubes here. I would need one on the where it is now and the other I need to bring across to here so I don't even know if um, this is why I got two save spots I swap the cubes I don't know, do I need to swap the cubes out like but this position here was like me after I just finished swapping cubes is that something I need to do Um, yeah, I'm, I am struggling. I'm not suffering, I'm struggling. Okay, I'll be honest. Exhaustion and tiredness is kicking in. So we swap the cubes, right? We swap the cubes. And... This is what we have. We can bring this one out, like so.
we could now adjust this one to point over here. then that's where the problem starts. We need a cube on this button here. We have the cube on the button here. We could, like I've done before, portal there, move the cube, back, drop down, go through the angle panel, come up the stairs, jump through, place the portal, come back up the stairs, fire the portal on the laser, fire the portal over there to give me the... Yeah, before we did that, we'd move the cube to here, then we'd fire the laser back to come off there, Pointing over there opens up the stairs. We can then come up the stairs, repoint it over here to respawn that cube. I just don't see. I don't. The, the, the big thing I'm missing. And it's really, it's humongous. It would, it would blow open the map completely. It's how do I get that cube to be able to open this angle panel? Of course, I'm missing it again. I've probably been through these same steps like 100 times and I just I, I don't even know what I've tried and what I haven't tried anymore I mean, sure, it's all well and good, but again, I now have no way at all to do anything with this side because I can't now get a laser through into here. way would be if I could do all of that and keep the if I could do all of that and I could keep a cube here So 
because I could then potentially open that up. For, okay, then I could potentially open that up. For, um. I've not already been down this road already. I, I honestly don't know anymore. On this freaking surface every time. Literally, I've had more trouble with this surface than anything else in this map. Drives me crazy. Drives me crazy. Okay. Uh, this this could be something actually. Really matter where I do this now. Take this back up to here. Is this progress? Is that progress? I don't consider that to be a tight angle at all. That laser catcher is very visible. I'm honest. So what I could do here... Now I could respawn this one. over here just so we don't get a respawn on that but this is looking good all of a sudden oh my god where did this come from where did this come from this has just come out of nowhere all of a sudden No, I don't think it has come from my brain, Coco. I'll be completely honest. Right, I need to check, though. Do you know what though? I didn't place something correctly. I'm pretty sure. No, I did. I did. I did.
I have a new map name for you. It's don't send me any more maps because they kill me. You know what, guys? I am going to be brutally honest. I have no idea where that came from. We have just, like, had a real last-minute surge. I'll tell you what, I can be a bit smarter about this. I'll position this over here. So that then I'm miles away from the catcher. I don't like that sad face, though. Because that to me indicates Adam's not happy that I the way I did something, but I haven't cheated. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen. We are done. Two hours thirty four. Honestly, that just came out of nowhere. That solution just, I, I don't know. I sat here for thanks for the thanks for the hundred again, Deathwish. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I sat here for so long, and it was just a case of getting the white plane cube into here. That's the bit I was missing, pretty much. Because once that was in here, we could then do everything else that we needed. Jeez. Well, good job, Adam. <laughs> you can send me more maps, just not for the rest of the year. Okay, that, that, that sounds fair. So, guys, thank you very much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. Um, what a couple of, well, a couple of days it's been. A couple of difficult maps, some real long slogs, and... Um, yeah, we have managed to get there in the end. Um, we'll be back on Saturday night with a f another Portal 2 stream. Stream number four, out of four, where we will continue on our uh, quest, maybe. <laughs> you know when you just like... Click through your queue to see what's coming up next, and then you see a certain author, and it's like... Oh, okay, so... Um... Oh, jeez, that was a thousand bits. Jeez, Deathwish, thank you very much, buddy. I appreciate that. I just saw... I just assumed. Thank you for the thousand bits, man. Jeez. You're a legend. All right, so... Saturday night, we may see ourselves in even more hell when we uh, get to play um, uh, Sheepdog Map. But guys, thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in. I really do appreciate your support. I just realized why well, you can't actually see that map. But, um, yeah, that's what's next. Agrophobia from um, uh, Sheepdog, can't even speak. It's time to end. Guys, thank you very much for tuning in. I really do appreciate your support. Thank you for sticking with it. I know it's been a long slog, but we got there in the end. Until next time, though, guys, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hope to see you at the weekend. And until then, happy gaming. Bye, guys. Catch you later.